So we went to Buffalo yesterday and we got all this shit. That know me well know that I love sauce. So I've heard a lot of good things about this bitchin' sauce. Got this banging Japanese multi-purpose seasoning for a Uh Yeah, it looks really good. It's also from Trader Joe's. So that's about this mushroom umami seasoning. So I had to grab this. I think it's basically dehydrated mushroom powder. Um, so it's gonna be super tasty. But yeah, I'm a big fan of cream cheese. So I'm always trying to find a really good cream cheese. Heard a lot of good things about the Trader Joe's one. I had to get the cinnamon raisin one. This is sour cream. Uh, the only good sour cream we've been able to find is to tofuti in Canada. So I wanted to try this one. If you've been vegan for a while, you've probably been missing out on like the store-bought fridge ravioli. So this is something that I've always been dreaming of. Uh, I love the brand Kite Hill. Uh, so this is tortellini stuff with almond ricotta. Sounds absolutely banging. A lot of things about the Trader Joe's ravioli, so we had to grab this as well. Every time we go to Costco, we grab a huge bag, so we had to get these bagel chips. Everything but the bagel chip. Massive fan of boxed mac and cheese. It's kind of what I ate uh, pre-going vegetarian or vegan. Um, so we had to try this. The branding was really cool. I've seen it advertised all over my Instagram. Huge fan of this brand. Uh, sometimes they carry this at Coven, but it goes out of stock so quickly that it's really hard to find. Um, these are like uh, peanut covered M&Ms. John's really excited about If anyone knows where you can get this bread in uh, Hamilton, we'd love to know. And that's our haul from Buffalo, New York. We went to Trader Joe's, Wagmans, and Target. Follow for more chef-approved food.